there! You may have heard of this thing called the Smash or Pass Challenge, so I figured I'd give it a go because not enough people have done it yet. First up is Thomas Sanders. Yes, this is such a look that I make up. That's... something. Oh, that's a cat. Well, I don't like men with too many muscles, personally. That's a nice picture. That's just genuinely a nice picture. But I'm gonna have to say pass. Next up, because I know I have certain <laughs> fans out there, is Dan Howell. <laughs> Please. To be fair, this is the thumbnail of one of his videos, but like, Hawaiian shirt Dan. I mean, Hawaiian if you count Santa Claus in a canoe. I kind of like this look. Aww. What is his name? Like Daniel Dream or something? I don't know. The hair is not a bad look. Honestly, I love this jacket. Look at his smile! It's so good! Hard pass though. Nope, not, uh, not about that life with Dan. So here we have Nicola Foti. I mean, he's got two heads, but he's pretty here. Like, this is a good picture. This is, uh, something. I like the colors. Ooh, and he's a furry. Nope, I'm out. Pass, pass, pass. Next up, because you really can't do one without the other. Anyway, next is Phil. Pastel really does suit him. <laughs> oh, look at his smile. He's just like a ray of sunshine. His eyes are so blue. Like, this is probably a filter or something, or like, enhanced, but... Oh, the funny filter. That makes everyone look cute. He's cute. Still pass. Then we have another one here. It's, uh... Oh, he's tall. He's PJ. Ooh, he looks so sad. This is actually from a short film he made, so I mean, he's acting, but like, you know, he can be happy sometimes too. He has a sense of humor, like in this picture, which continues to be a lot. I didn't inherit my mom's fear of clowns, but uh, I'm gonna pass. Let's speed things up a little bit. We don't need to look at multiple pictures. Other people don't do that. You just have to immediately judge someone on their appearance and be like, yeah, I'd either smash that or pass it, so... Let's do that. Evan, all right. He is a fellow Ace Spectrum person. Pass. Nice suitcase, Bri. Yeah, he's on tour right now as well. I hope that's going well. Pass, also. Ooh, hard pass. I heard he smells of milk. What kind of a name is Paint? Pass. You seem to try so hard to make everything art, but you're wearing those shorts and long socks. I'm not judging you, but I'm judging you. Pass. He's from Minnesota too, though, so that's cool. And then let's end with a bit of a lightning round. Pass. 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 Definitely pass. So that's all I have for you today. If you have any other people I should judge by their appearances on whether or not I find them sexually attractive, just let me know in the comments. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe because you don't want to miss more videos just like this. See you next week! I want to point out here that yes, I am ace. Yes, that means I don't experience sexual attraction. But that doesn't mean some people wouldn't smash. Wow, I'm just thinking of that bird video. I like sticks. Pick. Let me smash. But yes, some ace people do decide to smash for whatever reason, and that's totally fine and reasonable. But I did think it was funny how people are currently making videos and making money off of putting other people down based on their appearances. So, uh, <coughs> funny. Let me see if I can round up a cat for you. Oh man, this is gonna be a great thumbnail if she doesn't claw my face off. Look at this. Look at this cat. Look at her. She's so cute. <laughs> She's like, please get me out of here. Kiki.